Nivea pulls its white is purity ad campaign after outcry. A has pulled a deodorant ad that declared white is purity after people protested that the slogan is racist, and after others hijacked the ad's online campaign with comments about white supremacy. The ad, which appeared in a Facebook post last week, originally targeted the German skincare company's followers in the Middle East. It was intended to promote Nivea's invisible for black and white deodorant and depicted the back of a woman's head with long, wavy, dark hair that tumbled over an all-white outfit. Underneath the woman's locks was the slogan in all caps, WHITE IS PURITY. The caption on Nivea's Facebook post read, Keep it clean, keep bright. Don't let anything ruin it, hash invisible. The post was quickly condemned by those who saw it as promoting racist rhetoric. What the hell is this? White purity? One Twitter user said. Shame, shame, shame on you. Fire your marketing person and anyone who approved this ad. Another Twitter user took images of racist comments that had been left on the Facebook post, some referencing the Holocaust. Wow at Nivea USA. This is horrendous. The person wrote. Your comments are full of society's refuse. This cleared your marketing department? Hash per nightmare. Still others appeared to praise the ad, for the same reasons. The Daily Mail captured an image of a post by a white supremacist group on Nivea's Facebook page that read, We enthusiastically support this new direction your company is taking. I'm glad we can all agree that, hash white is purity. Nivea has chosen our side and the most liked comments are glorious, another Twitter user said, with an image of the top comments on Nivea's Facebook post. One showed Peppy the Frog, a meme that in recent years was co-opted by white supremacists and has been declared a hate symbol. Another showed a picture of Nazi leader Adolf Hitler edited to depict him with glowing orbs of light for eyes. A handful of threads on the anonymous online forum 4chan praise the Nivea ad slogan's apparent, if unintended, link to white supremacy and encouraged people to like all comments, buy their products. Is Nivea, dare I say, slash our guy slash? One 4chan user wondered, referring to supporters of white supremacist groups. Nivea has since deleted the Facebook post though images of the ad are still widely available online. Metro UK reported that the post remained publicly visible over the weekend and was only removed Monday after the news outlet inquired about it. Representatives for Nivea's parent company, Byersdorf Global, did not immediately respond to an email request for comment Tuesday. However, the company appeared to spend much of the day individually replying to people on Twitter who were outraged by the ad. The ad, 